I decided to make a quick video about the Microtech R11e LTE6 Mini PCI Express LTE adapter. Uh, first off, it's not actually really Mini PCI Express, it's actually a uh, USB. Uh, they're in the Mini PCI Express header on some motherboards, uh, but the one I was using did not have them in the header for that uh, embedded system. Uh, so I've opted to purchase this uh, WAN card to USB adapter with SIM slot from eBay. Just throw your SIM card in, and off you go. I'll show the uh, whole setup afterwards, but uh, this is just basically it. Let me just put it back together. Here's a video of it assembled in the adapter. I'll be connecting it next and uh, showing you it in use. I decided for an antenna I'd use this uh, medium gain Omni I have here. I think it was 9 dBi at 850 megahertz and around 15 dBi or so on PCS band. There's a machine here. You can see its uh, CSQ is at 22. It's an excellent signal strength. You can see the rest in the screen recording. So the first thing you're going to want to do here is uh, install firmware. I think it was in uh, Miss Non-Free, Miscellaneous mm -hmm. Non-Free. Um, but I'm just going to install the other non-free firmware as well, just because I don't have it right now. And once that's done, I already have some of the firmware installed. So you just click on your uh, No Network Manager or your um, well, Network Manager in general. It's in most distributions. And you should see mobile broadband by Lucky LTE in my case. That's what my sim is for. Now you just want to go and create a new connection for it. Just go through and select your region and then select your provider. Mine's not on the list. My APN name is Connect. And just throw under Connect. Under APN, throw in the word Connect. Now, my provider is picky about some of the settings here. They only allow TCP header compression, I'm pretty sure. And I think for the authentication, I had to take out MS Chap. It's an LTE. Have to remember to edit that. Lucky Mobile is resold bell. Slower than normal, it usually sets at about 4 megabits, but uh, it is what it is. And then the upload's coming in at a closer to the normal speed. note is it gives you a private address. I think it's natting in the actual card itself. I'm not 100% sure, but I think there's an AT command I can change to send to change that. If I find that later, I'll make a video or add it into this one. Now it also shows up as two separate it's two different ACM devices. The zero is the uh, actual device that you get your internet through and one is the uh, one that you talk to the uh, baseband module and you can send it AT commands to tell it to do different things. 
Um, seem to respond to a few of the Huawei ones I've tried before, but uh, you probably said that wrong. But uh, that's my attempt at saying that word. But uh, yeah, your mileage may vary, and uh, hope you found this helpful. It's uh, pretty straightforward to set up. You just uh, got to remember to get the PPP settings right for authentication methods and only TCP header compression. If you don't set that, it doesn't work.